In campuses across the country, it is moving in time. You good? Yeah. I'm just excited to get ready. You know, just moved all in. Kicking off the new school year, a new plan to cut college costs from President Barack Obama. Bottom line is higher education cannot be a luxury. It's an economic imperative. Every American family should be able to afford to get it. In his first stop on a two-day bus trip, the president proposed tying federal aid to a new system of college rankings. The, the proposal goes much further than many expected. It actually would change the way Pell Grants are distributed, and it would create a new federal system for evaluating all colleges based in part on the indebtedness of students and the money st graduates earn after they leave. By 2015, the president wants schools to be judged on affordability and performance, with students attending highly rated schools receiving larger grants, bigger loans. School costs now weigh heavily on family budgets. It's really, it's really sad that some of these kids are going to be paying for their, for, and their parents for college for several years to come, and uh, it's, it's mind blowing. With student debt topping a trillion dollars, will Obama be able to drum up support for his plan from Republicans? The question here will be, is the issue of paying for college so important to so many families that that motivates Democrats and Republicans to work together? At Catholic University, students welcome any help they can get. I think a lot of students are scared off from applying to different colleges because they are so expensive. So helping us out is great, and our parents as well. The president is hoping to increase middle class access to higher education by shaking things up. Tracy Brown, Associated Press.